All 14 peaks above 8000 meter in the death zones are located in the Himalayan range of Asia. In mountaineering, the death zone refers to altitude above certain point where the pressure of oxygen is insufficient to sustain human life for extended time span. This point is generally tagged as 8000 meter, where it is less than 356 millibars of atmospheric pressure. The human body functions best at sea level where the atmospheric pressure is 1013.25 millibars. Many deaths in high altitude mountaineering have been caused by the effects of death zone, either directly by the loss of vital functions or indirectly by wrong decision made under the stress, or physical weakening leading to accidents. An extended stay above 8000 meters without supplementary oxygen will result in worsening of bodily function and death. Atmospheric pressure decreases with altitude, while the PO2 fractions remains constant to about 100 km. So, partial pressure of oxygen decreases with altitude as well. It is about half of its sea level value at 5000 meter. The altitude of Mount Everest Base Camp and only a third at 8848 meter, the summit of Mount Everest. When PO2 drops, the body responds with altitude acclimatization. Additional red blood cells are manufactured. The heart beats faster. Non-essential body functions are suppressed. Food digestion efficiency declines. As the body suppresses the digestive system in favor of increasing its cardiopulmonary reserves, and one breathes more deeply and more frequently, but acclimatization requires day or even weeks. Failure to acclimatize may result in altitude sickness, including high altitude pulmonary edema and cerebral edema. Bottle oxygen can help mountaineers survive in the death zone and higher. No human body can acclimatize. The body uses up its store of oxygen faster than it can be refilled. An extended stay in the death zone without supplementary oxygen will result in worsening of body functions, loss of consciousness, and ultimately death.